Welcome back, folks. Welcome to Let's Play Woodruff and the Schnibble of Azimut. In the last episode, we were enjoying some healthy male violence, and I think we are uh, in need of some more of the same. I think we give it to the man. Yeah, he's always happy uh, to take our schools. Boom. I think um, after a while you get a... Um, there's a different animation that you can get, but... Let's leave for now. I think that was enough violence for this episode. Let's go back to the Brotophone Nuts. You may remember that in the last episode I got a bit stuck in the sense that I didn't know where to go or what to do. I actually figured out uh, where to go. Namely there's a new place where we can go. A place we haven't seen yet. And the funny thing is that I actually remember when I first played this game, when I was a kid, that I had the same problem, namely that I totally missed the entrance to the Kerkasakasse. Yes. There's an... Uh, Rudolf is getting... A, he's a bit impatient, I must say. There's a new place we can explore. And I totally missed that, uh, even though it's sort of obvious, but... There you go. Yeah, the Kerkasakasse. This is obviously a prison. This is one of the prison wards. And there's some graffiti, which is interesting that they tolerate that. And we could back go we could go back there to the Freudenviertel, and I'm very curious as to where that exit leads to. Ah and now the car is gone. So we now uh we now have a shortcut to get here, to, be, to get to here. And there's also another place, the laboratory. Which is a bit obscure. Okay, there's a, obviously a mad scientist, Professor Wirkopf. There's a poor Butzok sage who's being subjected to Cruel experiments, and there are some probes, um, some samples, I mean. Let's talk to the insane scientist. Machen Sie mit diesem armen Butzug. Ich experimentiere mit diesem Butzug. Ich versuche ihn zu trocknen. Interessant, oder? Oh. Let's, let's, okay, um... He just said that he's trying to um, dehydrate the Butzuk Sage, which, by the way, is the Sage of Fertility. Warum tun Sie das? Ja, aus rein wissenschaftlichem Interesse. Sehen Sie nur seine schöne Farbe. Wenn es klappt, <laughs> werde ich das Experiment in großem Maßstab durchführen. He said that he is doing this experiment just out of curiosity. And if he's successful, then he will um, make a big um, repeat this experiment. Meinen mit allen Butzuk? Nun, um alle Butzuk auszurotten, zu Ehre des Obersacks, der alle meine Arbeiten finanziert. Uh, yeah, he said that um, he's going to apply his method to all the Butzuks in order to extinguish them. 
Yeah, we're talking about genocide here. Ach, Sie arbeiten für den Obersack! Ja, und ich habe bereits alle Pflanzen der Stadt zerstört. Ich hasse alles, was wächst. Wie diese Horden von Butzuk, die sich überall vermehren. He works for the Obersack and he said that he already destroyed all the plants in the city and that he hates everything that grows, especially these Butzuks. Was machen Sie mit diesem armen Butzuk? Ich experimentiere. Okay, we only had had that dialogue. Okay, we clearly need to... Um, To free the boots, this boots of sage. Okay, can we disable this mad scientist with anything which is in our inventory? We could use the garbage on him. <coughs> But Woodruff, Woodruff isn't particularly impressed. Um, hmm. Okay. Let's see. Time for pixel hunting. Let's go to this. No. <laughs> what's what's so funny, Woodruff? Beg your pardon. Okay, let's talk to the sage. To this poor man, and there's. I just noticed something on the screen. Little Weiser, what's doing Sie here? Ich bin hier, um meine grüne Silbe zurückzuholen. Aber ich wurde entführt von diesem Idioten, der mich für ein Experimentierfeld hält. Vielleicht könnten Sie ihn zur Vernunft bringen. Er weigert sich, mir zuzuhören. Uh, and he just said that he was trying to recover his syllable, but that he was um, abducted by this crazy man. And he refuses to listen to him. And I just noticed this schrap this schnappelure seed, which I think I know where we are going to plant it. Yep. And I think you know too. But let's talk again to the sage of fertility. Ich werde es versuchen. Ansonsten haben Sie eine Spur von Ihrer grünen Silbe? Meines Erachtens ist nur ein Verrückter, der sich für ein Gemüse hält, in der Lage, die grüne Silbe ohne sein Wissen zu haben. Leider sind die nicht fähig zu sprechen. Hmm, that's interesting. Uh, regarding the um, the regarding any hints as to where his syllable might be, he said that only a madman who thinks that he is a vegetable could be in the possession of the uh, syllable of fertility without knowing it. That's a hint. That's an obvious hint. Fantastic. Okay. Um, let's go, let's try to talk to him one more time. I think we've run out of dialect options, but maybe we haven't. No, we have. Okay. Um, yeah. I think we're done uh, at the screen. Hmm. Okay, there's some machinery here, a ventilator, a switch. <clears throat> oh, and a um, something that needs gasoline. And I think that we are in fact in the possession. Thank you. That we are in fact in the possession of gasoline. So we use the gasoline with this strange device for no other reason than that we are in the possession of a gasoline canister and that's the thing we have to do even though I have no idea why we should be interested in enabling this machine. But now we've enabled this machine and now it does something. It blows 
Und hier sieht man auch die oberen Teile der Stadt, wo die Privilegierten leben. Hmm, interesting. So this is the upper part of the city where the privileged persons live. And I have a faint, faint idea of why we, um, of how we might have to use this ventilator. Maybe we, we have to do some paragliding. In any case, let's go back, I think. Yeah, let's, for the moment, let's go back. And explore some more. We can go to the Haus der Seligkeit. Which I think roughly translates to House of Bliss. Hmm, interesting. There are some insane people. And the Butzuk said just mentioned that only someone who thinks that he is a vegetable could be in the possession of the syllable of fertility. There's a word. Let's talk to him. <coughs> or just punch him in the face. That's another option. And there's a switch which we'll which we will leave alone for the moment. Let's talk to this musician. Or let's not talk to this music musician if you're not in the mood. And a programmer. <laughs> Woodruff also does not like <laughs> to talk to programmers. Okay, uh, an insane graphic um, artist. Another graphical artist and a normal uh, insane person, if that thing is, exists. Okay, you don't want to talk to them. Clearly not. Okay, who else can we talk to? This man, maybe. An artist. Traurig er aussieht. Er ist völlig in sich gekehrt. Total weiche Birne. Hmm. Wie kann ich ihn etwas heiter stimmen? Yeah, how could we cheer him up? Um, I don't think that the garbage can, uh, the garbage will do any good. Mm, maybe we could cheer. Hmm, I'm not sure. Maybe use the glasses? Nope. Okay, I don't know how to cheer him up. Um, there's a gamer. Okay. And a disoriented author. Okay, then don't talk to them. There's a, um... <coughs> a door we can't, uh, I mean, a... I... I don't know the English word, sorry. Uh, whatever it is, um, we can't open it. Yet, but there's a... Looks like a screw. Maybe you could use the bottle opener on it. Makes no sense at all, but... It was worth a try. Hmm. Okay, what else could we use? Um... Hmm. Okay, I may or may not figure out how to get this uh, uh, thingy here, which I don't know the English word of. How to get it und undone. When we come back, folks, and then we will plant a seed. So until next time, folks, until then. See you.